Thank you very much for having me. Good morning to everyone. Uh, my name is Zita Fekete. My business is Sound Soul Counseling. It's a uh, psychotherapy business. And uh, today I'm absolutely delighted to share with you my uh, delusions about psychotherapy. So uh, this, uh, this presentation was made for a longer um, talk. So what I can do today is just skip uh, many, many, many slides, and I would like to focus on one, which is, I think, the most important for you. Uh, I would like to share with you what I think about what is working in psychotherapy. But let's begin with some <coughs> important uh, thing. For example, if you ever, or your friends or acquaintances, uh, are in trouble and would like to have some help in the psychology field, you need to know that psychiatrists are doctors. They are working in the medical model, meaning they think that uh, mental issues are chemical imbalances, they will give you medication, nothing else. Uh, psychologists, who are, it's of course not black and white always, but mostly. Um, psychologists are the professionals who are mostly trained for evaluation and treatment. They are not really or not always interested in curing things or helping people out. If you, if you need, if you think you need, or your family need a uh, um, psychological solution for psychological problem. That's uh, the psychotherapist, counselors, or therapists, which can be, uh, they can have master's degree in uh, mental health field, social work, or uh, family and marriage therapy. This slide I, I skip, you have all in, in the handouts. If you are interested, please um, look after that. What I do think about different uh, illnesses uh, in very short, hopefully understandable terms. Uh, the origin of these illnesses are almost always how we learn how to determine. So you cannot say that this caused that or that caused that. So, no blaming of mothers, no blaming of genetics, everything all together when uh, someone uh, is suffering from something. Mm -hmm. The modalities of the psychotherapy there is, and there are many, many, many more. That was just uh, at first came to my mind. Uh, different people are working with different type of therapies. Um, don't go into the details because <laughs> the, the, the most impo uh, uh, important thing is <clears throat> that all of the uh, just a second, I go through it. Oh, no. <coughs> sorry I lost, lost what I wanted okay uh, so what I want to say is that uh, research uh, shows that uh, if the therapist believes in his or her ther uh, therapy modi uh, modality and the relationship is good with the clients there is not really there is no di really difference between those. Uh, type of therapies, it is all working if you are if you have a good relationship. And what should, every research shows that the relationship itself what really helps to solve the problems. Okay, um, different treatment options for the different kind of illnesses. Uh, I made a little list of the Jungian psychodynamic th uh, therapy because this is what I think the closest to the uh, human. Uh, complexity, the complexity of the human uh, psyche. So most of the time I use <coughs> the, uh, this method. And uh, now here is what I would like to uh, concentrate on today. Excuse me. <coughs> so when, when you think about uh, going to a therapist and you think that, okay, so what, what will be the magic? What will work? How will I understand better? How, how, will, how will I feel better after I leave? There is many, many, many different uh, elements of the psychotherapy what really works. Uh, first of all, before you go, uh, just think about it. You will think through and organize and, and sort out what you will uh, talk about it. it even itself, that, that is very helpful. Uh, many, many times people keep their um, things in secret. Now, even it's happened with me not so long ago that I told out something loud for my uh, supervisor, which was uh, in a long time kept in secret. I was completely aware of it. Still, I experienced that after I was able to 
put it together and say it out loud, it has a, a, a profound effect on me. So it really affected the way how I was thinking about that event, what I was talking about. So really, keeping in secret something can can harm you. So, um, I mean, I, I, <laughs> I don't encourage to share everything to everybody, but uh, <coughs> sometimes it really can help. Um, Many times I see that people who are struggling with some, some, uh, something, they are afraid that, oh, it's surely not normal, I'm crazy. And mm. you cannot imagine that uh, basically <coughs> everything is, is okay, Every, everything is normal. So we experience so uh, events when we can feel troubled, confused, um, in, in many ways, we can feel many different ways and it's all normal. Just not so long ago, I was talking with someone uh, to whom I said that, yes, of course, anniversaries are really hard. It's, it's everybody uh, who went through for, uh, some trauma. The time of the year when the trauma happened, it, it triggers uh, lots of stress and, and depression, anxiety, whatever you react, but some trouble. Uh, ventilation of negative feelings, I think, especially, this is especially uh, important for women as, as far as I see. So um, what I see most of the time, men likes to uh, find solutions as, as quick as possible. But for women, talking about what happened, the processing, the processing process itself uh, really helps to get rid of the stress. Um, clarifying ex expectation needs, um, what else? Or values, raising self-awareness is, is a really important part of every cognitive therapy. And here comes the insight, which is my favorite. Uh, this is very uh, in the very focus of my work to have so uh, to have the clients to see things in a, in a light that they haven't seen before. And the best analogy of what I find uh, is uh, how what they call. Um, insight learning at the time when in America and in the Russia, the last, uh, the, the, mid, uh, the middle of the last, last century when everybody was dealing with uh, uh, stimuli response type of learning, uh, Köhler in uh, Germany made uh, an experiment with uh, chimpanzees. And the experiment was that uh, in a room, uh, they hang up bananas from the ceiling, which the chimpanzees could not reach. But uh, he put different size and different boxes all around the room. And what's happened, they let the chimpanzees in, and after the chimpanzees were uh, looking here and there and around, uh, for a short while, after a short while, they put together the boxes, climbed up, reached the banana, and get it. And uh, nobody believed at that time that this is possible. Uh, of course, now we know that we are, uh, we are and chimps are way, uh, way more capable of doing many more things. But this is this kind of insight, or, or similar kind of insight, but I love to work in psychotherapy. When you have different memories, different thoughts, different feelings, different uh, evaluations in different spa uh, spaces of your uh, psyche, or different time of your timeline, and we can put it together to see in a different picture, see something in a new perspective, and having more um, capability to solve anything what, what causes problem for you. Um, we can use all of the others what you can you, you can read here. Just just show me that we have uh, I have two more minutes left, even less. So there is many, many, many others which have but all together uh, with a selection of art. So what time, what is the best to choose from? Now I use <coughs> relaxation, now I use a little bit of cognitive, now we try to get some insight. Um, I think this is the best way how we can tackle the psyche and really help people to find rational solution for the emotional problem. Thank you very much for your interest and for your attention. Thank you. Thank you.